Welcome to part four, uploading the schedule. First, we need to ensure we are on the right schedule that we want to export. As you can see, building two is highlighted here. Choose export, give it a name. And save the file. When you go to save, it will make an effort to open another page. Because this user does not have rights to upload the schedule to the kiosk app, they won't be able to do this. So the only choice for this user right now is to take the file, email it to a super administrator who could upload the schedule for them. The other approach could be the super administrator gives this individual the rights to manage the devices and the schedules for this digital signage location, AKA org. Let's see how that might work. Here I am logged in as a super administrator. I go under admin roles. Here I created a new role called signage. Select it. Let's first take a look at the privileges. Privileges that were assigned as we scroll down, we'll see just above admin API privileges, we'll see Chrome management. Select it, choose manage devices, and choose manage application settings. Let's assign the user to the organizational unit that, do, that we want them to manage the app and devices in. Select assign admins. Select my user, select the org, with this person, digital signage for building two, select, confirm. Now we'll return and do another export and see what this looks like. We'll go back into the Chrome Sign Builder app, say export, we'll give it the same name. Select Save, Overwrite, and it will open another browser window. From this browser window, we sign in, and it will take us to the kiosk setting and where I have control. Building to select it, remove any configurations that might be there, upload, pick our building file. Select OK. Choose Save. Now that we have our schedule uploaded, we should reboot the station. So to do that, select back on Device Management, Chrome Devices. Once again, it will open the building too, where we have control over the devices that are in that org. Open it up, choose System Activities, Reboot. This will now reboot that one device that's in that org. If I had multiple devices in there, I could do this for each and every one of them. As you can see, it successfully rebooted. If, however, it did not reboot, we would have to go to the device and reboot it manually ourselves. Please note that because this user was assigned a role with a domain, he can find his admin tools under the waffle in the top right hand corner. By selecting that, select more, and here is the admin tool. Once the admin tool is up, I have to sign in. And he'll see device management. And from here, he can either go into where the device lives and reboot it from there, or he can also select Chrome management.
select App Management, look at Chrome Sign Builder, make sure that they go to the kiosk settings, and there's Building 2 where they can upload the config file. I do want to mention that as you've seen back on this other window, there are other applications. They won't have any need for these other applications. If they did open them, as in this example, they only have access to building two. That's all the rights we ever gave them. Just wanted you to be aware of that. One of the last pieces I'd like to talk about in Chrome Sign Builder is the backup and restore. While on this computer I have two schedules, if I were to log in to another computer and open up my Chrome Sign Builder, these schedules would not be showing. What I would have to do is import. These schedules will not follow you from computer to computer. So how could I do that? Well, the first thing you should always do with your schedules is make a backup. Select Backup, give it a name, call mine All Signage, and I will save it. Now I can email that to myself, I can store it in Google Drive as long as I had it so that I don't have to recreate everything from scratch if something happened to my profile on this computer. To show you how the restore works, I'm going to remove these schedules. So if I logged into another computer, this is what it would show me. So then I would open up Restore, and I would select my All Signage, say Open. And as you can see, I get my two buildings back. The colors are not the same, but if I remove this guy, say Delete that schedule, Yes, I have the other twos, and they're back to the same color. And that's pretty much everything I know about signage. I hope you found this video informative. Thanks for watching.